Dark Dios, aka Shark Dios, rocking with MS Psych. Shout outs to Chaos. We got Josh360, aka 1080, aka Perfect Circle, rocking with Team Magneto, Iron Man, Sentinel, but in reverse order. Uh, Sentinel with Iron Man assist does a shitload of damage, as you can imagine. Highest damage in character in the game, highest damage in assist in the game. Plus, you got the unfly combos with uh, EM Disruptor. It's really fucking good, especially against Mag Fritos. Uh, but we're gonna definitely see if uh, Dark Dios can open up that robot. And he got him with the double snap city. Frey! 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 Oh! Tony's out the box! Damn, he murked that fucking uh, Iron Man pretty free. But uh, Josh360's still in it, though. He still got Magneto and Sentinel. Some godlike level characters, and let's see if he can uh, survive that corner. Nice, with the standing hard punch and the frame kill. Does he get the tag back into Mac Fritos? Ooh, unfortunately, he couldn't continue the combo. If he did, would have been a dead character. Dark DL's going for the Justin Wong okie dokes. He got the four way mix up on Wake Up. Also, shout outs to Lazy Reaper. He made a really good tutorial about that shit. There we go. That combo into Magneto assist, like I was saying. Unfortunately, Josh missed the unblockable, but he's still fucking the shit out of Scott in the corner. So I've said a million times, this game is fuck or get fucked. There ain't nothing in between. So decide which one you're gonna do, and which one gonna be done to you. Cyclops beaming shit. Sentinel stomping shit. We got kicking shit. All types of shit going on. Uh, the murder robot is really looking to fuck the shit out of Scott. Damn that unfly into Magneto assist. I told you all that shit's godlike. Right into unblockable, into death. J360. Mr. 1080. Dark Dios needs to uh, mentally regroup after that shit. Because damn he had that match and then he lost it. But it be like that sometimes. OGs no. Starting with the cable launcher. Quite an unorthodox start. And uh, Sentinel's okay. Thanks to that uh, friendly uh, bounce he had there. And a uh, nice little grenade placement. But he's got to watch out for them stomps and them donut dips. Very, very nice conversion right there. If he gets the bounce, he can get the tag. Nope. If he was able to keep the character high enough, he would have been able to tag in Mag Fritos and then tag in Iron Man for the J360 special. You already know. Some decent zoning from Dark Dios. Uh, but he's going to have a tough time, though, because uh, Josh generally knows how to get around that because he does that shit, too. It's pretty easy to beat something when you do it yourself, although it doesn't always work out that way. All right, we got some nice uh, robot battles, a little four-piece action. Commando always going through everything. That assist is so fucking ridiculous. He has invincibility in his legs and the middle of his body when he starts up uh, Corridor. Fun fact that's not so fun when you get your shit rocked. Iron Man looking to keep on that pressure. Uh, we know Josh can open him some Sentinels. He does that shit in his sleep. But uh, Dark Dio's doing a pretty good job versus uh, Iron Man right there. He's throwing him out. Scent Cap does sometimes give Iron Man a hard time. Mainly just because of the damage output. And uh, obviously fucking Sentinel's limbs reach almost all the way across the screen. But that's Josh 360. He's walking that robot to his grave. Doing some flashy shit. Throw reset. Probably unnecessary. But uh, he's bringing back in the murder robot. Not almost enough to chip him out. Nice little duck alpha counter right there. Shout out to duck. And we got some nice cable commando action. Chucking grenades. But he's playing real risky though. Because Sentinel is right up in that grill. And he can get fucked up real quick. But he's probably just going to chip him out. Doritos Locos in this bitch. Yep. Chance of survival, zero. Cable with one meter. He, he got to work real hard. Because Cable is definitely a character that relies on meter to be fucking shit up. He can't be shooting shit if he don't got shit to shoot with. You know what I'm saying? Like, he can shoot a few gunshots, a few regular lasers. But if he really wants to fuck your day up, you got to have some meters. Alright, nice free HC. Almost had the punish from Mag Fritos. That would have been... That would have been the set right there, actually, if he was able to get that conversion. Josh got to be careful, because Scent Cap is anti-Magneto, unless you get that double snap city. Oh, he goes for the crossover. The Dark Dios is out of there. He's like, nah, this is Shark Week. Check your local cable provider. Oh, very nice. Clutch win from Dark Dios with the upset. Coming out to the final match here, and I'm guessing this is an homage to Chaos. With uh, Josh putting uh, Spider-Man as his last character. I've never seen him play this team. But let's see uh, let's see how this shit works out. And you know that was a YOLO super. Probably a fuck up. But as I've said before. Drop opportunities do happen. They will happen. But you still gotta do shit anyways. And uh, Josh is obviously fishing for that hit. 
That was real risky of him, but nice tag. He saved his Tony right there. But uh, Dark Eel's looking pretty good. Chucking them grenades, dropping that cap. He said he's getting fucked into the corner with the four piece. No fries. Free drink though. Free drink on two base. We got a little Home Depot Proton Cannon. Aisle 14, but don't ask an employee. They're just going to point. They ain't going to walk with you. Damn. Spider-Man's getting his shit fucked up. Let's see if we can get a little uh, Max O rush down here. Okay, a little three piece. Put him back into the corner. I can see Spider-Man with drones being pretty good. I think Chaos rocks with that sometimes. All right, let's see if we can get some uh, web dashes here. He's going to need some of those to get around all that Sentinel bullshit. Damn, and he's out the box. All right, so we got uh, Sent Cable Cap versus Sent Iron Man. We know Josh can do plenty of dirty things with Sent Iron Man. He's got a personalized septic tank, you know, Department of Sanitation and all that good shit. But he's going to have to work real hard because he's at a major life disadvantage. Never mind. He's still got his best character, though, Iron Man. So you know he's going to be going for that comeback. And uh, really, all Iron Man needs is one clean hit, and he could end this whole match right now. But uh, we're going to see if Shark Deals can do some zoning. He's, he's actually been doing really good at the zoning, making shit real frustrating for uh, Josh 360 here. And he's just trying to fly back, fly back and call Cap. Effective strategy since 2001. And Dark Deals with the upset, sending Josh 360 to loser's bracket. Clutch. Thank you.